Hello everyone, my name is Natasha and I am part of the York County Library. Welcome to my virtual art painting one-on-one video for December. Today, you will create holiday candles. The materials that you will need for this holiday candle painting are red, paint, yellow, gold, dark blue, army green, brown, dark gray, and white paint. You will need carbon paper, tape, a picture of holiday candles, canvas board, pen, flat paintbrush, a round brush, a cup with water, and a paper towel. Now that you have all your materials, we will begin. The first thing you need to do is trace your holiday candles and garland onto the canvas board using carbon paper, paper, carbon paper, pen, and tape to secure it. If you're not familiar with doing this, take a look at some of my earlier videos on how to use carbon paper. Now that the holiday candles has been traced onto the canvas, you are ready to paint. The first thing you want to do is pick up your flat brush. And I use a 3 8 inch flat brush. And grab your dark blue paint. Put some dark blue paint on your flat brush. And begin to paint your candles like this. You don't have to go as fast as I am. You can take your time, of course. This is how the speed that you're comfortable with doing. And you want to take your time and paint within the lines as, as best as possible. And you want to paint your candles. And I'm going to continue this because once you paint all of your candles, we're gonna to move to the next step. Now that we have painted our candles blue, we're gonna take a little, little bit of the dark gray onto our flat brush and just kind of stroke, let it lightly brush it on the left side of your candles like this. Okay to give it just a little bit of shadow. And you don't have to necessarily go back into the paint. Just a little bit should be enough, like that. And you wanna put your paint brush in some more water. And while that's drying, we're going to take our round brush I have a six round brush, and we're going to make the flames that's coming from the candle. Uh, so we're gonna use a little bit of gold, yellow, gold and yellow, and we, we will make our flames. Like that, and on this one as well. Okay, and in the middle, we're gonna clean our brush first. And then we're gonna take some white paint, just a little bit. We're gonna go in the middle of the flame Okay, like that. All right. Okay, now that we have done our flame, we're gonna take our flat brush again. It should be clean. And we're going to get a little bit of blue. and paint it right here at the top where the flame is coming out. I'm gonna take a little bit, I'm gonna clean my brush. And I'll take a little bit of white Um, 
blend it there just a little bit like that okay and then I'm gonna clean my brush again and then I'm gonna pick up my round brush I'll get a little bit of yellow and have it like the wax is coming the flame is making the wax come from the candle okay like that all right guys now that we have completed that step we're going to move on to the bulbs with the garland okay so take your time Paint it as, um, as slow or as fast as you need to. And you can always stop and pause it if you need to as well. Now that we have completed the first steps in making our holiday candles, we're now ready to start with creating the garland. And what I liked, what I did when I created my painting was I started with my flat brush and I made my circles which uh were red so i just went around like this and made my circles and i filled it in i kind of went back again sometimes you have to go a second time around with it but that's okay Okay, and that's one bulb. I'm going to go around like that. To make my second bulb. Okay. And then we had one more little itty bitty red bulb so go around again and again you might need a little bit more paint just to add to it so it won't look so dry okay now that we've painted our red bulbs, we're now ready to paint our gold bulbs. Okay, so I take a little bit of gold, I do the same thing. You can have them gold or yellow, it's really up to you. to go over it a couple a few times so don't worry about that you may have to go over at least two or three more times according to the type of paint that you use okay i have one right here so i'm gonna do go over it like that and like that okay all right those are my bulbs okay okay now that we've painted our bulbs again try to if you need to go over it again please do don't worry about messing up or not being in the lines that's okay all right i'm just gonna add a little more paint to it into that one okay all right now we're ready to add a little bit of brown just a little bit 
um, to the bottom edge of it. So I'm gonna mix a little bit of brown, a tad little bit of red. If you're not comfortable with mixing, then just use a little bit of brown on the bottom there. Okay. And one more. All right. And I'm going to do the same thing with the gold. And right now we are working on the actual pine needles. So I'm going to take my round brush and I'm going to use some of the dark green. I'm just going to lightly just start stroking. Um, again, if you haven't finished the garland, don't worry about it. Just keep, go at your own pace. Take your time and go at your own pace. There's no rush because uh, you can also pause and go back. Uh, I'm going to use this brush to paint my garland. And again, I'm just using light little strokes to make the garland. And as I'm doing this, Everything else is trying. Again, I use a little bit of brown on the bulbs. Uh, as you can see, you can use a lighter brown or a darker brown. That's up to you. And I chose a darker brown because I felt better with that color uh, than the lighter brown that I was using earlier. So this is the garland the actual pine needles. Okay, so you can make them as thick or as thin as you want. That's up to you. I'm gonna make mine thin. I'm gonna clean my brush. And now I'm ready to add some light so I'm using some light on the uh, candles and on the garland. And then I'll be finished with the painting. So I'm gonna add just a little bit of, just a little bit of light there. Just a little. Add some with the red. Okay, a little bit more lighter. Okay. And then on the candle. Now that we have put some light color on the candles and on the light on the bulbs, now our painting is complete. If you like this video, please 
share, like, comment, or subscribe to my virtual art painting videos. Uh, I want to thank you for watching. Again, this is Natasha for my virtual art painting one-on-one video, um, Holiday Candles. Thank you again.